Okay, welcome, challenges. Everything starts tomorrow. So I've got some stuff here, I'm gonna go through it with you now. This is the starting blocks. This is gonna tell you everything you have to do to nail this challenge. So I'm gonna go through the logistics really quick. Four classes in a week, no more than two in a row. Work hard in the classes, stretch, okay? Look after your muscles, your muscles look after you. Understand the fundamental importance of form. Don't just go through it a smash, don't go through it a million miles an hour. Take your foot off the gas and get it right. Learn the right way to do things. That will translate into better results and results that will remain. Plenty of rest, three days a week, no classes at all. Four days a week, you're smashing away. Breakfast exercises, these are mini workouts that you do on opposite ends of the days that you train, okay? Now, these are optional and they're gonna come in the roll call emails from starting from tomorrow. You can do these breakfast exercises or you can skip them. If you have limited time and you wanna focus on something that's gonna get you better results, focus on learning about food and that's gonna be what this roll call's all about. Focus on improving your form in class, okay? Don't just take the breakfast exercises, smash them 100 miles an hour with no respect for your technique and then bring that bad form back into class. If that's what you're gonna do, we'd much rather you cut them out and just did it with us, do it the right way, okay? Obviously, if you wanna add them in, be our guest. But make sure you're doing them in the right way. Next part is the confessional. You're gonna send that in on a Saturday, but make sure that you fill it in every day. Two reasons. First of all, it lets us see what you're eating so we can guide you what you're doing right and what you're doing wrong better results. Second of all, it's an act of discipline. And if you want to capture this challenge in a sentence, the challenge is an act of discipline. That is what it is. And so just this very act of doing something, putting yourself out to basically write everything that you eat down, filling it out, sending it in, reading the feedback. We found time and time again, people that complete confessionals get better results in the challenge because they simply put more effort into each aspect of the challenge, of which the confessional is a huge aspect. So do it. Couple of little points, the Facebook group, it's a great resource, loads of questions, motivation, food form, form fitness, all the trainers are on there, five and a half thousand members are on there. Don't sell your cat on there, please. Uh, just send an email to info at circuitfactory.ae if you're not a member of it and we will add you. Measurement's gonna take place 30 minutes before the start of your first challenge class. Don't show up as the class is about to start and expect to get measured, please show up early. And finally, roll calls. I think one of the key components of the challenge is the fact that we try and teach you guys, not just smash you. We want to basically work on this as well as the body, because if you get this bit sorted, then the body will generally tend to fall into line. The roll calls are nearly always focused on food because your results in this challenge determine on how disciplined you can be with your food. And that discipline, I believe, will go up like this if you actually learn what is going on with your food. When you become aware of just what it is you're putting in your mouth and what a disaster our food environment has become, you have that barrier, that layer of protection that will hopefully make you less likely to veer towards the processed crap and more likely to make the right choices. So please, heartfelt uh, request from me. Please watch the roll calls and please apply them. And obviously give me as much feedback as you want, bad and good. Okay. That's it. I want to say one more thing. Good luck. <laughs>